Good morning to you all. Today I would like to talk to you about Gabriel Towers. Gabriel Towers is an apartment complex in uh, Kansas City, Missouri off 16 and Jackson. I have a bunch of friends who live there and each and every one of them tells me that it's not a good place to live. I lived there for 19 months and I can tell you right now it is not a good place to live. The management there doesn't care about anything that goes on there. They don't want to fix up the place. They don't want to help the tenants out. In fact, there's one woman I know named Diana who is uh, almost bedridden. And uh, she's got issues with her back. They don't want to uh, accommodate her. She's given a list of accommodations that they by law have to accommodate but when uh, she called Michelle the property manager of the place Michelle just laughed at her now I've had my own run-ins with Michelle she's not a nice woman she does not follow the law and she does not follow the rules she makes fun of people for living there and for all the things that they do I have several friends that live there and they're all living in the same bed bug infested, cockroach infested, rat and mice infested conditions. Things don't work there either. The management there has openly admitted that they do not want to nor will they fix anything there. The only place I can think of that's even any worse is 63rd in Manchester. I lived there for two months. Now, when I was in Gabriel Towers, I had issues with just about everything, including my plumbing being shut off for no reason and no warning. That is against the law. You need to give 24 hour notice or 48 hour notice of water being shut off, even in an emergency situation. There were days when the staff just wouldn't show up to work, even though they were supposed to. They write people up for nothing. That's not good either. A lot of my friends are still living in this, these conditions. I don't think it's right. And I don't think it's appropriate for management to be treating people the way they do. Anyways. I think the best thing and the best course of action that anyone could take is to band together and call HUD. And KC Tenants Association is another option. Not that it's the best, they have their own agenda. I do believe that if you call HUD and deal with HUD, they will uh, work with you more. Like one of my friends right now is in fear of losing her apartment due to uh, mismanagement. And everybody I've talked to, including myself, agrees that management there needs to be fired and replaced with someone who actually cares, or at least shows some human compassion, unlike what's going on over there now. It's kind of a shame, really it is, of how they're treating the people there. Anyways. I'm in Maine, and Maine is wonderful. Um, the person who just passed me by was a bicyclist. There are a lot of them. But yeah, like I was saying, Gabriel Towers needs to be uh, under new management. They really do. They need to have people there that actually care. And that's something that they don't have right now. Anyways, if you liked this video, please consider subscribing. Leave a thumbs up. Uh, hit the bell and don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment. And my heart goes out to everybody at Gabriel Towers. It really does. I hope things get better soon. And I will keep you all updated on the situation going on over there. Thank you and have a wonderful day.